Dennis, you just came um, you came into the Australian Open this year on a wild card and you've just beaten the world's number two in just under five hours. You said that you played the match of your career. How are you feeling? I feel great uh, to be a winner today, but uh, my body tells that I'm not really feeling good. <laughs> just tired a little bit. The opening set was nothing short of incredible. It was 89 minutes and 122 minutes were played. What was going through your mind when you finally took that first set? Uh, I mean, it's a lot of emotion. Uh, and uh, when I f we finished the first set, I just realized that we play one and a half. And uh, I just started to think that I need, we need to play at least three more. And I was like uh, shocked a little bit. <laughs> But then I just trying to play and concentrate on the game. And in 2001, you were in a serious car accident, which meant that you were unable to play tennis for two years. Uh, where did you find the drive and the determination to come back onto the international circuit? Uh, I want to say my thanks to my mom. And so she uh, believing on me all the time and just say, keep saying that I can come back and uh, just practice. Uh, and then it uh, wasn't really bad accident, so I can walk and I can run, and uh, I'm happy to be here. Do you think there was a sense that you had nothing to lose today, so you were able to play your best tennis? And if so, are you hoping that you'll carry that notion on to the next round? Uh, I think I play better than my best today. <laughs> uh, and uh, yeah, I just need to keep my emotional now uh, after winning and uh, just prepare for the next match. Yeah.